There are three treatment uh, modalities or techniques that doctors employ in the treatment of lung cancer. The first is surgery, the second is chemotherapy, and the third is radiation. Many patients will have one of these three or combinations of these three. Moreover, many patients have these done in different order. All of this depends primarily on the stage of the patient. Surgery is often the best option for early stage cancers so that tumors that have not spread uh, to distant parts of the body are um, uh, good candidates for surgical resection. Even if the lymph nodes are involved in the central part of the chest, oftentimes we can take these patients to surgery. These patients, which are commonly known as stage 3A patients, are nowadays treated with chemotherapy or chemoradiation and then taken to the operating room. Recent studies have shown that these patients, which historically were considered unresectable or non-operative patients, uh, now have good outcomes using this combination of therapy. The other way that uh, patients are treated is with chemotherapy. Chemotherapy is a uh, medication that's delivered to the body <clears throat> and its function is to kill the tumor cells uh, throughout the body. It circulates through the bloodstream. For this reason, chemotherapy is a very good way to treat tumors that have metastasized outside of a local area in the chest. <clears throat> the last way that we treat patients is with radiation. Radiation is often another way of controlling the disease inside the chest. Uh, the radiation can be delivered to the tumor itself or to the lymph nodes in the central part of the chest. But again, all of these decisions are made usually by a team of physicians. <clears throat> it should be emphasized that lung cancer management nowadays is a multi-specialty uh, phenomenon. It's no longer the case that a single doctor can really understand all aspects of surgery, chemotherapy, and radiation. For this reason, at many academic and big referral centers or hospitals, uh, we have lung cancer teams composed of surgeons, uh, medical oncologists, radiation oncologists, and pulmonary doctors to see the patients together and make a decision as a team to employ all of these or various combinations of these treatment modalities.